I am Ann Santucci, and I'm a teacher of AP Government and Politics at Crystal Lake South. This is our first year teaching AP Politics and Government, and we are excited to introduce the new civics course. The course is designed to be project-based, which means that the students are acting out roles during the units. We have five units. Currently, we're in our election unit, and as an example, students have chosen to take part and to act out roles such as campaign staff or candidates themselves or interest groups or media and they will perform the role throughout the unit while learning about specific procedures of the election process here in the United States. Another example I can give you is that in the initial unit they work as delegates to determine if the Constitution as we know it today should be ratified or not. And they're allowed to incorporate their personal perspective as well as learn about what the delegates at that time decided was important for the United States. Um, we have about a chapter or two a week that's required for the students to read on their own time. They are, um, as of right now, expected to take one to two vocabulary quizzes a week in terms of workload. Most of the work needs to be done on their own at home. There are times in which we have uh, set aside in class to work, but most of the time we are working through the material and experiencing what it's like to be part of the government. It is a fascinating class for the students to take because every week something comes up in the news that allows them to connect to the material that we are covering. Questions are relevant to what's going on currently and they are learning from a perspective of contemporary as well as traditional as to what our government was set out to become and what it is today. So they can make comparisons of change over time. I think that the students as of right now um, are finding that the course is helping them better prepare to become a citizen as they are entering into a time of their life in which they'll become voters. So we work on the procedure of voting, we register them to vote within the class, and we help them understand what their role will be from this point on. Thank you.